So today, I'm going to show you how to mod this game, Grounded, so that you can play it in virtual reality. And this is one of Luke Ross's mods, of course. And I'll leave a link in the description so you can go and get this mod and try it out, because this is fantastic in VR. I mean, what's better than giant bees and giant ants and, and everything's giant. Anyway, without further ado, let me show you how to install this mod. So I'll download the mod first. And then go to Grounded, highlight it like that, right click, scroll to Manage, then, oops, scroll to Browse, uh, browse Local Files, like that. I'll we'll close this down so we can see that. There it is, that's Local Files. Uh, close that at the back. So there you go. And there's the mod. Now, of course, before you install this, run the game at least once you know just long enough so it can create a, a user profile for you otherwise this won't work do that first then open main double click on it go to binaries and open that double click and then to win 64 double click you see now that's where you drop it you get this drag it over and just drop it there and then highlight it and select extract here and what it'll do it'll extract it right here which is what we wanted it to do which is brilliant then just underneath that mod you can remove that if you want you can delete it don't have to see that file real config right click on that oh no you don't just double click on it double left click on it and this will come up I'm just gonna have to lift my headset up so I can click on yes click on yes and it'll do all this shit, look, blah, 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 and it ends up cleaning up, all done, press any key to continue. If it says anything other than that, all this blah, 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 blah stuff, then you've done it wrong. So I'll just, I'm just going to press any key. Duh. That's it. Piece of piss, wasn't it? So now you should be able to play this in virtual reality. So we're going to click on play and see what happens. Let's hope it works. I've actually played the game before. So that pops up and you need, as it says there, just press pause on your keyboard. Or just press down on both your thumbsticks like I just did, simultaneously. That's a big word, simultaneously. Press any button, it says. See, look, there's a red ant there. Uh, press... I just press... Uh, is it the I'm playing with an Xbox uh, not an Xbox a PS5 so it's the the zero button I'm pressing to get past all this and now I'm going to press the lower button which is the X button but okay you can do all this on your keyboard if you want to and I'm going to I'm not going to select that I'm going to select single player so like I said I'm using a PS5 controller did I say that well, I'm just at it now you can use a PS4 or an Xbox controller. You know, hold on a second, I'm on. Continue. I'll select that. Now, if you don't start off in first person mode, then you can all, I'll show you what to do. Press down on your thumbsticks like that, and this will pop up. And you can use your mouse now. And if you go here to grounded, and then to camera, you've got a choice of a first person or a third person. If third person is clicked, unclick it. Well, ticked or checked. Uncheck it and make sure that first person is checked. All right, now press down again or press pause on your keyboard and that will disappear. And if you're still not in first person view, then all you have to do is press U on your keyboard. That controls the camera view. I think I'm crouched here. No, I'm crouched now. And here it is. Isn't it, isn't it lovely? I mean, it really is. It's very sharp. It's it's brilliant. It's like it's native VR. See that over there? That's my rucksack. So every time you die, you drop your rucksack. And you have to go back and get it. You drop all your stuff that's in it. And as you can see, I've died quite a lot. It's something I'm extremely uh, proficient and persistive. Uh, persistive, that's a new word. I'm very good at dying. I just am, in any game, not just this, just any game, Luke. Oh, 
I've been trying to kill one of them for ages. Can't get close from them, they run away. So what we'll do, well, there's an ant. Right. Ant crossing. Yeah. Ants are generally quite friendly. This one's a nice friendly one. Oh, hello. Ant crossing. It's run away. But the, the uh, soldier ants aren't friendly. Those will kill you. I think there's a big soldier ant over here somewhere. Well, they're everywhere. They keep killing me. And there's big spiders and all. There's all kinds of shit in here that want, and everything wants to kill you. Well, not everything, but more stuff does. So this is a survival game. You've got to survive. You're only a young child. Oh, look what the... Look at that spider over there. Not coming up. It's coming over here. Now, I'm not strong enough to kill spiders as big as this yet. And I haven't got any armour. You can make armour and everything. You've got a base camp you can go to. Where's that spider gone? And I think this is the part of the machinery up there that's made me as tiny as I am. It's a shrinking machine. It's a little bit like that movie, you know, where they get shrunk. Oh, fuck. Only I shrunk the kids, that's what it's called. There's a spider over there. I saw a, a snoring spider last time I was playing this game. It's a, it's a spider. There's a spider. Oh, shit. Oh, there it is. PD senses tingling. Look, it's asleep. Should we go and attack it? No, there's one over there as well. They're all over the place. Where's my, uh, where's my base? See, look, now I'm lost. I'm going to go over here. You're in your back garden, apparently. And you've got to get home. How you do that, I don't know. And there's quite quite a lot of gameplay in this, from what I've been told. Oh, Luke. Aphid. Oh, it's an aphid. Can't catch them, though. They run away too fast. Don't know what this is. That's grass. Not the grass you smoke. Can I jump? I forgot how to jump. Oh, that's how you jump. There you go. Oh. There's food in there. What was I saying? I forgot. Was that blood? No, it's not blood. It's not an horror movie, Michael. Or an horror game. So, look, there's a bee up there. So it's really a very pretty game. The graphics are very, very impressive. I think if I get on here, I can do something. Uh, oh, can I press one of these switches? Oh, look! Oh. What was that? Looks like this one. thing hooks up with those lasers. What lasers? I don't think that worked properly. It seems like the machine needs all three lasers to function. Oh, right. Maybe there's a way to this fix one. them? No, I don't know how to fix them. I'm going to run over here. I'm too bothered about these spiders. Is there any around here before I start fixing stuff? Let's make sure there's no spiders. Anyway, I'm not going to fix stuff because I've got a pizza in the oven. I'm starving. I've just finished work. And I've showed you how to install the mod. I don't want to spoil anything for you by playing the game for you. Look at that. Oh, there's my house. I wonder if that's my bedroom. What's that big fucking green thing up there? Oh, it's a tree. Anyway, wasn't that easy? Isn't this brilliant? What's down there? Let's have a look down here. There's something down here. That's dirty water. What through dirt? Oh, those are all right. Look, you can make gas masks out of them. Maybe kill them. I don't want to be killing stuff. Let's run. Luke. It's one of these. There's another one. Oh, this is my place. I built all this. I can sleep in there if I want to. So when it gets dark, it's better to have a sleep. Because it gets a bit scary when it's dark. And now I've got all my shit in here that I can do stuff with. Look, I can do all this stuff. An analyzer. This computer, I haven't got that online yet. There's this, I don't know what it is. There's them, I don't know what they are. There's that on the floor, I don't know what that is. And I don't know what's happened to this table. And this is a workbench. Uh, I've told you that's where I sleep sometimes. 
Well, all the time, really. Uh, and that's where I died. Many, many times I've died. Uh, these are the times where I, have, I just haven't gone back out to get them because it's too dangerous. Anyway, like I said, I'm going now because I'm starving and I've got a pizza in the oven. And I think I've got a pale ale in the fridge. I like pale ale. Anyway, I'm going now. Bye.